why they still that's their core sound many fresh one of the dopest artists just like that ever you know for me produced that bounce sound yes. you know what i mean like this yes. it pulled rolling, you yeah rolling, it rolled yes. you in man it was just nice yeah we on boss talk one-on-one -on -one. The, the the music down here is different. They had a bounce sound one while. They still that's their core sound. Many fresh, one of the dopest artists just like that ever. You know, for me, produced that bounce sound. Yes. You know what I mean? Like this, yeah. it, it pulled you. Yeah, it rolling, rolled yes. you in, man. It was just nice. Oh, I at my age, I can tell you, I I love it. Snitch, I'm a real big time. King of the hood, everything rules. Mm -hmm. I mean, seriously. Of course, maybe he was smart. Every single track he was laying, he would bring it, play at the store, and see the audience, you know, reaction to it. Oh, yeah, he would yeah. always do that. Oh, yeah, because, you know, there was no way we did not know every song mm -hmm. or every, you know, thing. <laughs> There's no way because, he, you know, he made sure he just marketed it. There were no computers or anything to do it. Yeah. I mean, yeah. You, had to, you know, like these guys worked very, very hard. They don't have the help of what we have today. You didn't have no yeah. computers to do that. I mean, they had to really, so, I mean, it was beautiful, all how this thing bloomed and emerged and the work they did. And gotta give them credit, they all worked very hard. Wow, man, just, you know, just a P, delight to hear. He was a little bit, you know, he, he was a little bit more of a visionary, you know? Yeah. He really, that's why he is who, who he is today even. You know, he's got an amazing vision, and he was willing, he was willing, you know, to do this. Yeah, yeah, P was always, Absolutely. always seemed like a business mind. He Absolutely. tells a story as about a young, his parents, person, yeah. giving, his grandparent giving him $10,000 a month. One of his grandparents gave him $10,000, and he went to L.A., and he got him a store. Exactly. A, 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 you hear this story. And he played basketball, remember? And he played yeah. basketball. Yes. So this guy was unique. So they're a little bit more in, in, enlightened. Did you ever have a chance, and this may have been before the music, because it was so early on, Kevin Miller, his brother that passed away, was that before the music? Or do you even remember? No, I remember all of them, you know? Okay. Yeah. Kevin Miller was alive, and, and during the time the music was circulating? I mean, I'm trying to figure out exactly. Like, you know, my dates, remember, I'm old lady. Correct. My dates all, like, get all mixed up. So I wouldn't be answering that very, very, very well. Very well. Yeah. I, I, because I'm supposed to get said, silk. If I get silk, I can ask yeah, him. Exactly. And, um... Who's Kevin Miller? That was that the was brother his, their that brother that passed died. that died. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, and his children come and visit. You know. Oh really? Children. He did have children. I didn't know that. They, I definitely didn't know that. They come to visit. That's nice, man. But they're 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 pretty close though. You know, sees children all of them. They're fairly close. They're pretty close. And they're very they're close, but they're also very kind. You know, kind, good. They've done good. they've done well. I mean, the kids have done something you know that's a whole thing that people don't talk about the and kids. think about the kids have to come up in a in a now they have to readjust and put themselves in a situation where they can't even move around like others used to move no, around. exactly so it's a different lifestyle for exactly. them so that, they have to be well, something. Like going to school they've gone to school and done you know got educated and doing something positive and i always see Birdman, son i'd be like this dude is extra quiet like my son like my son, I talk a lot, but my sons, they ain't gonna do no talking. But her, his son always, Birdman's son always seemed quiet to me when I would see him, he's a young man. And I just, like I said, I always, I did good as far as with people from Louisiana. I always loved the people from Louisiana. I, I would always What's say What's your that. spirit though? That's what it is, your spirit. I, I, I would do good with them every time. I don't, I mean, you know, that. Don't, don't get me wrong. There's people that may not like me, but I'm gonna still love them anyway. But at the end of the day, it's like, man, you know. They were welcoming you. They were yes. very welcoming. But, you know, a lot of, th remember this is where a lot of things started here. You might have some family, <laughs> your roots here. here. Yeah. And people, we feel it, you know. Yeah. You, you gotta, you gotta look at it well, like I'm, that. Well, I was more than five miles from Louisiana. I'm, I'm like in, on the Texas side. Right. Texas side. So I'm, I'm right there. Uh, Cattle Lake is what separated me and Louisiana. And Cattle Lake run in Louisiana. And people have to like go places to make money though. So you know, and, yeah. And also stories are left, you know, behind because struggle is real. And, you know, they went play wherever they could do a little work. Yeah. yeah so yeah. like, you know, you probably, your soul and spirit's here. So we feel it. <laughs> Thank you so much. No, man. that's a good thing though. You want to be, you want to feel that. You want to feel universal like that. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101.